For whatever reason, sometimes pipe can get damaged, leading to pinholes or cracks and then leakage. But fret not, for these little things known as repair slip couplings have made dealing with cracks as easy as can be. All you need is a set of pipe inserts, a marker pen and a pipe cutter. And if you're feeling like performing a professional installation, get some wrenches which will later be used to get those nuts as tight as possible. Making sure your water supply is turned off. First off, you need to mark the endpoints of the fitting equidistance from the damaged area. Next up, cut through either side of the crack so the pipe has square cut ends. If you're cutting through metal pipe, then afterwards you need to deburr the ends. Now's the time to insert those inserts. These are essential in any sort of compression joint as they prevent the pipe from cracking or warping and gives the fitting something rigid to squeeze the pipe against. Next, let's attach that slip coupling. Just shift one of the pipes laterally so they are no longer aligned and slip the fitting on. Now slip couplings closely resemble standard straight couplings save for one key difference. Inside they don't have an internal stop that prevents pipe from going past the halfway point in a straight coupling. This is what makes the next step in the process possible. Slip couplings are designed to work with pipe that can only be moved laterally and not brought closer together after having the damaged section cut out. After shifting one of the pipes laterally, you'll be able to slide the coupling all the way onto one of the pipes before realigning them and sliding the coupling back across. Now simply tighten the nuts up as you would with a standard straight coupler to lock the fitting into place. It's that simple. For repair couplings, other fittings, piping and industrial tools, please visit our website or give us a call on this number.